What's up everybody, this is me Nick here. I thought I would do something a little different. Um, instead of always uh, doing unboxings, which there will be more unboxings. And by the way, take a look at all those boxes there. <laughs> yeah, a lot of boxes. Anyways, uh, if you hear some noise in the background, it's WrestleMania 16. I'm testing out one of the DVDs right now. I just wanted to ask you guys a question. For you old school wrestling fans out there, are you more of a DVD fan or or are you a VHS fan? I'll give you my answer right now. I'm more of a DVD person. I love the VHS, okay? It's classic. You pop it in the drive. Uh, it, it makes that click sound. It, it's like amazing, right? Um, you know, with the DVD... Uh, there's two things that I like about the DVD. I'll, I'll tell you some things I like about the VHS and DVD. The thing I like about the DVD is the fact that um, there's bonus material that is on this that would not be on the VHS because this is uh, three and a half hours. That's including all the bonus material. The VHS is only the chapters. It's 85 minutes long. And this was a good VHS uh, but this one has extra moments and matches on here. Uh, I think also uh, it's very cool to have like a match insert. You wouldn't get that with the VHS, and um, that, you know it's pretty cool, man. Uh, I like having an actual like case, like a thin case. I will tell you some advantages the VHS has. Uh, number one, the DVD is more prone to. Um, Unless your VCR eats up your uh, VHS tapes, which a lot of people have problems with. I never experienced that problem, ever. Uh, but DVD DVDs can get scratched. Um, and if they get too beat up, they could stop working. Unless you really abuse the VHS tape, you're never going to have that happen. I mean, I have a little crack here, uh, but it still plays fine. I got, that, I got it like this many years ago. Uh, another thing about the VHS tapes, um, which is a good thing and a bad thing, is that you can, um, if you say like you uh, want to leave it at when Mike Awesome power bombed that guy to win the uh, hardcore title, that moment, and then like when Kurt Angle and Booker or Kurt Angle and Stone Cold went to go find Booker T at WWF New York, you could pause this on the VHS tape, take it out of your VHS drive, and then when you want to go back and watch it, or you can leave it in there. You can turn it right back on, and it goes right back to it. With the DVD, uh, it doesn't stop uh, anywhere. If you if you take it out and you put it back in, you have to restart it again. But at the same time, you have to rewind on the VHS tape to uh, get it back to the beginning if you want to start from the beginning again. This automatically starts from the beginning, so... Uh, yeah, I love the VHS tape. There's nothing wrong with the VHS tape, but um, if you're like an old school fan and you're only going to get one, the VHS tape or the DVD, like if you were to get one, get the DVD. Um, my advice, be very careful with your DVDs. Leave, leave, leave. I can't stress this enough. Leave your DVDs in the case. That's the most important thing. And also, please, please... Try to avoid putting your fingers on the bottom of the disc at all cost, okay? Uh, that's another thing. Uh, and another thing, if you have a Blu-ray drive, please put them in the Blu-ray drive. Don't put this in the Xbox 360. Don't put this in the PlayStation 2. Don't put this in a DVD player like that. I'm telling you, man, when you put it in a DVD player, it eats the shit up slowly. When you put it in a Blu-ray player, it never, ever does that like an xbox one which is where i always put my stuff on i'm telling you man uh you know uh please god forbid but if you also want to get both get the vhs tape then but i would prefer the dvd over the vhs tape all right